Welcome to the jungle. So, what do you want to do? Alrighty. Let's take a look at this. If you need some pointers on how to get around this place, just click here. If you want to play along with the story, click this spot here. Remember, if you have any problems, just click on me to get back here. So, Hakuna Matata. You know, no worry. One special morning, the animals of Africa came to Pride Rock to celebrate the birth of Simba, the new prince. Everyone rejoiced, except Scar, the king's brother. Well, I was first in line, until the little hairball was born. Dad, 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 come on, Dad. Okay, okay, I'm up, I'm up. When Simba was old enough, his father Mufasa took him to the top of Pride Rock to show him the lands he would someday rule as king. Look, Simba. Everything the light touches is our kingdom. Wow! Look, Simba. Everything the light touches is our kingdom. This is a pouncing game. Try to sneak up on Zazu before he can fly away. If Zazu starts to turn around, hold down the mouse button and you'll crouch down in the grass. You are a great little pouncer, did you know that? Boy, 
I'll bet Zazu is going to be pretty careful around you. What about that shadowy place? That's beyond our borders. You must never go there, Simba. Later, Scar told Simba that the shadowy place was really an elephant graveyard. He said that only the bravest lions went there. Well, I'm brave. And remember, it's our little secret. Simba and his best friend Nala told Zazu they were going to the watering hole. They were really planning to go to the elephant graveyard. Along the way, the cubs teased Zazu. I beg your pardon, madam, but get off! The elephant graveyard was full of old bones and geysers. The two cubs had a lot of fun exploring the graveyard for a while. <laughs> Zazu? Yes, sire? Take Nala home. I've got to teach my son a lesson. Mufasa was very disappointed that Simba had disobeyed him. The cub explained he was only trying to be brave like his father. Simba asked Mufasa if they would always be together, and Mufasa told him to look at the stars. The great kings of the past, 
look down on us from those stars. Those kings will always be there to guide you. And so will I. <laughs> Click on the stars as they twinkle, and you can make pictures in the night sky. You made a very pretty picture there. <laughs> Wasn't that fun? Isn't that beautiful? Scar desperately wanted to be king of the Pride Lands, so he plotted with the hyenas to get rid of Mufasa and Simba. Stick with me, and you'll never go hungry again! <laughs> Scar tricked Simba into waiting in a gorge, while the hyenas started a wildebeest stampede. Hold on, Simba! <laughs> 
Mufasa saved Simba just in time, but could not save himself from Scar. What have you done? Scar told Simba that Mufasa's death was his fault. What am I gonna do? Run away, Simba. Run. Run away and never return. <laughs> Scar and the hyenas took over the Pride Lands. <laughs> Pumbaa and Timon rescued Simba from the desert and brought him to their beautiful home in the jungle. They taught him about Hakuna Matata, no worries, no problems, and how to enjoy their way of life. Can you help Timon rustle up some grub? Just click on the bugs as they scoot by. Thanks! Mmm! Thanks! Ooh! Mmm! Thanks! Ah. <laughs> ah. Oh well, Akuna Matata. Simba grew up in the jungle with his friends Pumba and Timon. One day, while Pumba and Timon were out hunting bugs, a hungry young lioness sprang out of the high grass and attacked Pumba. She's gonna eat me! <laughs> Simba? Well, how did you? It's great to see you! Let me get this straight. You know her, she knows you, but she wants to eat him. And everybody's okay with this? Did I miss something?
Simba was surprised to discover that the lioness was Nala, his best friend. This stinks. Oh, sorry. Not you, them! We've really needed you at home. No one needs me. I'm not the king. Scar is. That night, Rafiki came to Simba and led him out into the grasslands. There, Mufasa appeared in the sky and spoke to his son. Look! Father? Simba, you have forgotten who you are and so forgotten me. No. Remember who you are. You are my son and the one true king. Remember. 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 Simba decided that he had to return to the Pride Lands and take back his kingdom. He challenged Scar to see who would be king. The two lions fought as a fire raged behind them. Simba won the battle and became king of the Pride Lands. Remember. With the return of the rightful king, the Pride Lands were restored.
One special morning, the animals came to Pride Rock to celebrate the birth of a new prince. Simba and Nala watched with pride as Rafiki raised their young cub high above his head, continuing the circle of life. So do you want to hear the story again, or do you want to leave? Well, see you around the jungle. Keep in touch. Thank you.